Okay, we're back. Excellent. I think in theory I just boosted a shit ton of things. So things should be slightly better. I hope. Are you guys watching my recordings? <laughs> yeah, edited some things. This might just kill my computer, but whatever. So I'll say again, this is uh, because my recording got it. This is uh, Neo Scavenger. You can go directly to the website bluebottlegames.com to play it yourself from their website, download the demo, or quite frankly, buy the game. I do have a masochistic computer skull, I do indeed. So, um, doing this game, it's a roguelike, I'm going to be doing it as myself, quote unquote. So, I've taken hacking, electrician, metabolism, hiding, and melee as my benefits, and of course, I am myopic. Sad face, need glasses, this is true. So, uh, let's begin. You wake up disoriented. Slumped over the base of an empty cryo sleep pod, still damp from cryo fluid, the thick dust from the floor clings to your skin, leaving a clean spot on the ground where a large O5 is painted. Across the room, there's an open door to the hallway and a broken window leading outside. Just as you gather your wits, an unearthly scream erupts from down the hall beyond the doorway. Something is coming, fast. Um, let's see, we can either hack the door to stay shut, rig the door to stay shut, or prepare to fight. Let's just hack it, because we're master hackers, don't you know? Using a common maintenance override code, you switch the door controls into maintenance mode, forcing the door closed and locked. The creature howls madly, slams into the door, and rams it a few times before its muffled sounds proceed again. Nice. Let's search the console for some records. You check the console for any patient info and come across three records. Attack number one, Anton Blubber. <laughs> Fat was he. Committed 2012-11-11. Emergency contact, Angela Blubber, 45 Campbell, blah blah blah. Billing info, <laughs> they would have that. Tank number five, so that one was ours? Was zero five the one we awoke in? No data, Philip Kindred. Interesting. Okay, finish. They have a great GPU and then it took an hour to the knee. Alright. We're gonna jump out this window. True story. You decide to go outside and see if you can figure out where you are. Avoiding the broken glass, you step onto the still you step on the sill and outside rustling some plants that have grown wild in the area. It's cool outside and damp, probably morning. You're in the parking lot of a cryo facility, but everything looks disused and in disrepair. Plants have pushed their way through the pavement and over the facility. Worst of all, nothing looks familiar. You don't remember this place, or even who you are. Your station mounts, but you can get, but you catch it or put it in check. Might as well take a look around. <laughs> Welcome to Jurassic Park. Yeah, that's just a quick tutorial, I know what I'm doing, and we have no towns around. This is disappointing. I'm actually gonna go back into the cryo prison thing, so I can explore down the hallway here. Outside the cryo chamber, there's a debris filled corridor that looks disused. You climb over piles of refuse and rubble and come across a blocked doorway. A plaque on the wall reads, Exam RM17. Forcing the barricade aside, you peer into what looks like a clinic exam room. While there appears to be little worth looting, this room looks like it'd make a great hole-up site. Nice, I got a campsite, folks. Let's see, examine the electrical panel. Looks like the lighting is still in good shape, the wiring's blown. If you could tap the add joining power conduit, that might get them running again. Okay, I got this piece of paper here. So I need a Pearson Ravager multi-tool pocket knife, four sorted screws, washers, blah blah blah. Okay, yeah, you can leave that on the ground. Basically, uh, notes like that will give you recipes for various things. You need to hold them in your hand to read them. 
Can I? Yes, I'm naked. Lo 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 lo. Got a wrist flat in Philip Kindred. Interesting. Dude, I have. That's that's what I'm using. Yeah, I got uh, dual two gigahertz. You know, thingy. It's not good. I do enjoy being naked. Thank you. You know this to be true. Yup, it's a vent. Sure would be nice if one of those mechanics or maintenance guys were around, though. The sigh, if only I took the mechanics perk. Anyway, let's uh, depart. See if we can uh, actually do some things. But we got a campsite, which is nice. So let's go south here. Examine what this is. Blueberries, yay! Into the forest we go. What do we have here? Just trees. Kinda Ooh, a lake. Consume it. Yeah. Uh yeah, this uh very much survival type of game, you need to worry about all your stats. So you need to keep you need to eat, you need to drink, you need to sleep, you need to do everything in this game. That's why it's kind of nice. And we found a town. Huzzah. I haven't got a weapon yet. Kind of annoying. Cooked school over a campfire. Yay. I didn't buy one. I haven't bought one yet. This is the inbuilt one. People are asking. Uh, how much did my microphone cost? I haven't bought one yet. Need to. As you approach a town, there's no sign of activity. Buildings stand in ruin, vehicles are overturned and blackened with fire. Explosion marks radiate outward from walls and pavement. In the distance, strange-looking creatures circle in the sky like monstrous livery vultures. The world has drastically changed from what you knew. Some sort of cataclysm has befallen Earth, returning mankind to the Dark Ages. And along with it, your hopes of finding a warm meal and some answers. You decide to look around and scavenge what you can find. Yeah, the the built-in microphone, the thing is, the reason I don't, I can't let's play anything decent with it is because a built-in microphone, the way it works, if my computer starts to heat up and, you know, the, like the fan starts blowing a shit ton of hot air out, it messes with the mic incredibly. I'm talking, you can't understand the thing. You might have seen it if you watched a few Sign of Storm Let's Plays. At one moment you hear just the voice go, blah, 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 just go mental. That's what happens. Um, so basically I can only do desktop games as it were with it that's why I haven't basically done any videos oh, even though I could do I could do the Kai series which I'll probably do but um, yeah I need to buy one I'm probably gonna do one this weekend why thank you anyway we're gonna scavenge some shit Unless anyone's opposes an abandoned what office tower. Come on, oh, there's nothing there. Yeah, we can use the hiding skill to increase the sneak, but if we do that, we get less loot because obviously you're going slower. Anyway, let's just loot. Oh, cool, we actually got some stuff. Gonna admit, wasn't expecting that. Although these footprints indicate that there's someone here, or ooh. Damn it! That's a shame. Okay, let's go. Don't be retarded. Thank you. Let's fill these bottles up. I'm actually gonna leave all this here. I'm gonna make a mental note that all this is here. Because until I get a bag, I can't carry any of that shit around. Oh god, that's a guy with a gun. That's a guy with a gun and I have no more turns to move. Oh shit. This will be the shortest, shortest let's play ever. Yeah, he's come to get me. Right, he can see me, I'm barefoot. He's barefoot, he's got a hunting rifle. Pray to god he hasn't got any, you know, sort of... <laughs> Pray to God he hasn't got any bullets in it, otherwise I am dead. So we have choices, we can dodge, 
as Piccolo would have us do. Run away, bravely so, advance, retreat, fall back, do the Grimith charge. It works so well in Civil War generals. <laughs> Threaten him with my... <laughs> May I remind you what I look like at the moment? <laughs> I look like this, a crazy man. Uh, I'm actually going to take cover. Okay, he's actually ran towards me now. Kinda open, he wouldn't have done that. Threatening him, that will not work. Okay. God as my witness, this will not work. Holy shit! <laughs> Jumped up, like in a net. <laughs> he just took a step back. He was so <laughs> desperate retreat. Oh my god! High chance of tripping on terrain. Yeah, let's just fall back. Okay, he's chasing us. Okay, we're going to tackle him to the ground. Because nothing can go wrong here, right? Success! We're both on the ground! <laughs> I can either do a bubble roll or get up. Let me get up. And let me tackle him to the ground again. Come on. Success! <laughs> Keep tackling him to the ground! Oh god, can't tackle him to the ground. Oh god, not good. Not good at all. My only saving grace is we're both barefoot, so... I could pro if I run away, I'll probably... Be Let me just punch the fucker. Oh, lovely! I missed, but he tried to hit me and missed as well, so he's vulnerable. So he's recovering, so he won't be able to attack me. I want him on the ground, so I can kick him. Okay, he's on the ground, he's vulnerable. Yes, he's still on the ground, let's kick him in the face. Oh, my lower ch- How did he pull me to the ground? <laughs> Son of a bitch! Okay, let's jump on him again. Just... He's dodging? S Dodge this! He's still on the ground? Fucking kick him! God damn it! Stop pulling me to the ground! <laughs> not cool, bro. Not cool. He's on the ground? Player needs a moment to recover. He keeps hitting, but I keep missing. It... Oh no, I bruised him. I just punched him twice in the stomach. Awesome. Let's tackle him. Wait, 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 wait. What am I doing? The guy's already on the ground. I'm not gonna tackle him again. It's gonna make him hard to hit, right? It's gonna make him hard to hit. It just. You know, casually attack. I actually hit his leg. Nice. Okay, he's on the... Now he's standing up. I want him on the ground. Because if he's on the ground, he can't shoot me or hit me with his rifle. I'm going to assume... Yeah, he hit me with his rifle. God damn it. Kick him! Ooh! Oh, critical hit! I, he's bleeding, he's coughing blood, and I'm okay. <laughs> Holy shit! I was not expecting to win this. <laughs> okay. 
He's still on the ground. Kick him! Okay. Got to Make sure he's on the ground at all moments. Oh crap, I missed. Okay, well I'll pull him down to the ground, see how he likes it. Yeah, suck on that bitch. I wish they had like health bars here though, instead of having this text down here. Not that it's kind of hard to read, but I don't really look down there. I'm sure you guys don't either. Not only is he coughing up blood, he's bleeding. And if you look at me, I just got a few minor bruising here. I got, what's this? Minor bruising there. You know. I got slight hypothermia, I'm getting there. Wait, what the fuck? I can't. Let me... Okay, I'll threaten him again, I guess, because I'm not retreating. The dude's coughing up blood. Let me punch the fucker. Oh, he's in severe pain. I'm just punching the shit out of this dude. <laughs> this is awesome. Oh, okay. I'm getting some lucky hits. Oh, shit, I'm coughing blood. He got a good hit on me. Bandit is bleeding. We're both coughing blood. He's already on the ground. I don't want to tackle him if he's on the ground. Yeah, he's no longer on the ground. Tackle him to the ground. Come on, why won't you die? Dude, son of a bitch. I'm weary, am I? Dude, you're in a battle for your life. Uh, yeah, you can't. If you wait to turn during battle, the guy will just beat the shit out of you. I do not suggest to... Ooh, that was a... Ooh, yeah, that's... Um, I'm in trouble. Put him down to the ground. How is this guy not dead yet? Ugh, I know what's gonna happen. He's gonna kill me. I'm gonna kill him, but I'll be too fucked that I won't be able to do anything else. Yeah, I'm in... Sh I'm unconscious. I'm in shock. I passed out from unbearable pain. <laughs> I have a fractured rib? Well, that's what multiple rifle butts to the face will do. Oh yeah, let's check. What's he got? Minor bruising, moderate pain. Got... Broken finger. I'm all kinds of fucked up. No, no, it does. He did lower chest, so it makes sense. But damn it. We were so... We were doing it. Bandit's bleeding. We're both gonna die together, you son of a bitch. I died first, but... And there we go. That's the game. Thanks for watching. Oh. Shall we go again? Give it another shot. Yeah, that's... This game is... Unforgiving. I'll tell you that much. Good God, man. Uh, hiding... Opia and... Metabolism. Okay, hack the door. Not reading this shit again. Information in there is not useful. We know this to be true. And there's... Ooh! Actually a few scavenging points over there. Let's go into the hallway. What I'm curious is where did the monster quote-unquote go from before? Let's have this here. In the hand. Oh, what's this? I forgot about it. Gold talisman on braided leather string. Okay, so they let you cryogenically freeze yourself with bling on you. 
It's good to know for future reference if a doctor says, I want that. Okay, so it's over here, over here. Oh, someone around here. But let's scavenge. Let's scavenge this open field. Because Law knows we're going to find stuff here. No useful items. Law. And now I'm out of turns. Okay, what's on the ground? Nothing. Scavenge. Stretch of forest. Oh, I found something. Ah, uh, mushroom. Useful. Not gonna lie. It's something to eat, innit? Scavenge again. This other stretch of forest. And still nothing useful. Le sigh. Okay, we got the same message from every sort of town you get to. The first one at least. Uh, a locked storage shed. How can I even get in there? Yeah, I don't have any loot because I haven't got lock picking, so. Yeah, I figured. Assortment of screws and washers. We need those for the lighting thing. And I'm now shivering because I'm cold. Fantastic. And I found another mushroom. Git. What the? Are these not the same? Mushrooms, mushrooms. Fuck that noise, eat them. I thought you could have multiple ones, but I guess not. Okay, let's head slowly but surely to this other town. I'm hoping for cloves. Because without cloves, we're not going to survive long. We're going to die of hypothermia or some shit. Let's get some more screws. Scavenge. Damn it, another locked shed? Come on, guy. You're not helping me out here, are you? What's this? Handful of berries. I'm eating a shroom. To gain some berries. I want some clothes, a plastic bag, if you please. Have I been active on the Voltron army at all? I posted like three posts in the last two days. About, you know, possible playing board games together or see if people wanted to do a pen and paper RPG or just, you know, I, I want to, you know, see if anyone has any projects or something going on. I know someone was trying to make uh Oh, unable to see because difficult conditions. Like a bitch. I can see again. Ooh, there's a stream. Yeah, I don't think m many people have time for said things nowadays. That's the problem. Okay, there's definitely someone here. But, you know... And I have to do it. Scavenge this shit. Storage shed. At least this one isn't locked. Oh, god damn it. I finally find a bag. Olive covered hoodie. One shoe. Lol. And a sleeping bag. That's nice. all this in the bag if you please let's work all this in the bag if you please put some wire and twine in there now we have to survive this fight first with we have no idea god damn it I'm blind why am I blind <laughs> Okay, can't see the target. Oh! Oh, there's the target. I honestly think I can take him. No, it's because of weather conditions that I'm blind. Don't. 
Okay, can we? No, we can't. Shit. As night falls, you notice this. See, we've already outlasted our previous incarnation. As night falls, you notice there's a bright glow coming from the east. Look to the east! Easily visible through the tree tops. It's no guarantee, but it could be a sign of civilization. Or Gandalf. Maybe even a lead on where you are or who. And if nothing else, it's as good a landmark as any to strike towards. Oh god. Basically, that's telling you look at your mini map. This is where you are. This is where you need to go. I have not made there, made it there yet alive. Because, you know. Oh, come on, it's night. You know, you're gonna. Son of a. Okay, another storage shed. Not much loot, but... Oh, shit! Screw that, we just got a ton! Oh my god! Is that a weapon? Holy shit! Got some blue jeans! Got a top! It's a top! A <laughs> grey t-shirt! Another hoodie! Another shoe! Another shoe. Let's use our shoes. Oh, this is awesome. Right, let's sort this shit out together. Got... Uh, that's 86. Yeah, I'm keeping this one. Brown t-shirt. Brown t-shirt. Okay, I've got the maximum number of t-shirts on, I think. Keeping the top, because I need that for later. Hoodie, 42, oh, this one's better. Yeah, I don't care about the uh, electric components in there. I will, however, take this monkey wrench. Because it's another weapon I could possibly use. I think. Okay, that's... Oh, I'm happy. Got a weapon, got some actual clothes on. I'm actually gonna take the, this moment to remove the hospital gown. Uh, let's wear a hoodie then t-shirts. No, let's let's do this practically, shall we? Um, damn, that's a good condition t-shirt as well. You gotta wear you wear the brown one. Then the college one. Then the olive covered hoodie. Which will take actually this. Just in case. And then back there. There we go. Uh, 73. Better sleeping bag. I like. This is good. I'm actually happy. Now watch as this game screws me over. <laughs> I'm well rested, I'm okay, I'm not cold now, because I'm actually dressed. No useful items. Problem is, it's night, I can't see. I can move like one hex per turn. This is not a good place to be. Oh! Nice recipe. Boil clean rags in a pot. Okay, I need a lit campfire, two dirty rags, one water, one metal saucepan. Thanks for the recipe. Ooh, two recipes. Uh, chavach. And, uh, disassembled what? I read that. Scroll pelt glove? Okay, <laughs> interesting. Why do people think I'm screwed? Dude. I'm gonna head towards the cryo facility. Nice, I can see again. You see, things are looking up. What do we got here? This is the lake. I'm gonna actually have a drink when we get here. I'm gonna search the open field. And we found a shit ton of water, but I actually attracted the attention of someone. 
What? That's not what I want. I want you to drink it. Drink. I don't care if you need to pay. Drink. Sadly, I haven't got any bottles to keep this stuff, but... Yeah, I doubt the A. Oh, oh, he's armed. He's feeble and frail. And he's barefoot. I think I can take this guy. First, I'll shout at him because he's got a melee weapon. Jaffa Cree! And he ran away. <laughs> Come on, bitch, you wanna take me out? Okay, he's vulnerable, barefoot, feeble. I gotta take this guy out. Got my crowbar. I'm actually gonna do a normal attack. I smacked the looter's left leg with the crowbar. Damn, that's gotta hurt. Where you going, son? I'm gonna Jaffa Cree you again. Where you going, punk? I'm gonna do my sneak attacks. They seem to work so well. Oh, he's parrying. Lower stomach with the crowbar. Come on. Player tries to attack little but misses. Oh, I'm exposed. But he sprinted away. Jaffa Cree! <laughs> uh, oh, scavenge. Open field. Find me loot. Oh, he actually came to see me. Okay. I'm just gonna take cover and hang out playing Nintendo. Advance on the cover. Dude, this guy wants to take me on. I'll fucking get him. Nah, wasting time with him. Let the guy go. Quality torch. Good to know. Oh, guy's back. Did you bring a friend? Okay, we're getting lots of recipes here. This is interesting. I'd quite like to survive. I'm not gonna lie, because uh, this is the best run of this game I've ever had. <laughs> Never gotten a crowbar before. I'm assuming I can actually open locked sheds now. And I've, got, I've reached a major town as well. I wish this is a safe feature, I know that's kind of blasphemous to say in terms of roguelike, but still. An abandoned apartment building. Okay, if I use both the crowbar... I can only use one. So I sneak less, I get more loot. Fuck it, let's do it. Okay, I attracted some unwanted attention, but I did get... Oh my god, I got a shit ton of shit. Okay, let's... Let's look at this shit. A bit more clearly. First of all, that's my alternate weapon. Second of all, let's see what we got here. We got some antibiotics. Get... Saucepan, don't really need that. Got some food. Let's see. Got some. Okay, I got a lighter here. This is actually a plastic bag, so don't need those. Hmm. Saltine crackers. Okay, seriously, I want to get. Nah, it's negligible difference. Okay, these are all empty cans. Blue jeans. Can I wear any more? No, I can't. I 
put on these jeans. Get all this. I don't think I, I haven't considered the thing of weight. Must say. Um, like the easiest recipe for rags is just to rip up your gown, but it hasn't given me it yet. Okay, painkiller bottle that's empty. Okay, let me get this bottle. This bottle. You know what? Just fuck it. Just grab these. Just why make this complicated? Just grab three of these bottles. Four. Sorry, my math was wrong. <laughs> And dirty rags. Don't need those as of yet. I will take saltine crackers. Ooh! Here we go. Disassemble tarp shelter. So now that we have a tarp. If I... No, not yet. Okay. Well, still, we'll take the... Now, let me see. If I take that there... Take the multi-tool, because we need it. Take some more saltine crackers. Take those there. Take those there. What else are we missing? Let's take some ketchup and some jelly beans. Name of the game is Neo Scavenger, good sir. You can go to the bluebottlegames.com website and play directly from the browser, like I am doing. And I think we're going to stick with crowbar instead of monkey wrench in terms of weaponry. Because, uh, yeah, I... <laughs> oh, the condition on the crowbar, it might break. This is true, but... Fuck it. Anyway, I'm glad with that. That's... Let's see who... Ooh! Okay! We're fighting a werewolf. We're fighting a werewolf. Ah, shit. Shit, shit, shit. Take cover? Okay, he's advanced. Um, this makes me vulnerable. Let me threaten them. That's worked so well before, right? Oh god, this is not gonna end well. Let's get like a lucky hit on him. And I missed completely. Okay, let's go for the ankles. Okay, I've fallen to the ground, but so has he. Let's kick him while we're down. Success! I bruised his lower chest. How are we doing? We haven't got a scratch on us. We're doing okay. Let's put him down to the ground again. Yes, <laughs> success! Okay, he's dodging. Let me get back up here. It's Gordon Freeman, this bitch! And my crowbar has disintegrated in my hand. Pull out the monkey wrench! And I'm bleeding. I am actually bleeding. This is, this is bad. This is very bad. Ooh! Leg trip. Sweep the leg, Johnny. Holy shit, they worked! <laughs> um, shit, I am bleeding intensely now. This is... I've got a giant ga... Oh, a minor cut. I'm still bleeding to death. 
Until I get some rags, I can't fix that, can I? I don't know. Okay, time to run, I think. Uh, no, retreat now, I'm fine enough away, I think. Yeah. Yep, there he is. The game, once again, is new scavenger. Okay, we got some shit, and I'm sure Dogman is not pleased with us taking his shit. Need to just fucking drink that shit. Need some crackers. Damn it, that made me thirsty. God damn it, making sense game. Okay, I'm in pain, so uh got some bioblock antibiotics. Where's my did I have painkillers? There we go. Nice. Wasn't kind of was kind of open to not use the painkillers so soon, but you know, use them or lose them. And let me guess. Oh no, it's a bandit. Okay. Let's see. He sees me. I am still bleeding. He is barefoot. I'm going to take cover. And <laughs> let them fight it out. Yeah, fuck them. Okay. Nothing on the ground, yeah. Let me see. Abandoned office or storage shed? Which one do you think is more likely for me to get medical supplies? The abandoned office tower or a storage shed? Well, it, punch is an attack in the f if you play the Batman game for NES, where you don't punch people, you Batman them. You Batman them in the face. Okay, we got... What appears to be... More... The I... Jesus Christ. You'd think this was the Apple Town. Okay, storage shed. Enter. I probably should have kept my crowbar just so I could enter places. Ooh, that looked more promising. Uh, still nothing really. I will grab the tops. Okay, that's better. And still fill up on these. Okay, we're full on those. I think time to bravely run away. I have severe stomach pains, things like I have diarrhea, I'm fighting off an infection, I'm in minor pain. Holy shit, what the fuck happened? I got one scratch and I'm, okay, I got I'm poisoned, I got diarrhea, weak immune system. Who knew getting a wolf bite? I'm turning into a werewolf, is that what's going on? Tell you what, let's consume these antibiotics. Apparently there's still one in the bottle, okay. Yeah, pills here. Do I dare scavenge this place? I do. Abandoned house, storage shed, abandoned house. Come on, house. Damn it, unwarranted attention, but... I got more painkillers. Nice. That helped. What else we got here? Blinkies. Gotta eat those. Squ how to cook squirrel. Let's take that so we can learn it. I don't know how you heal in this game. That's the problem. Apart from taking pills. 
more saltine crackers, let's load up on those. They take one inventory space each, the bastards. Well, I can't take it with me, then eat it. Fuck that noise. Okay. Well, worth it for the painkillers, I guess, but... Really depends. Okay, I need a lit campfire, dirty rags, water, and a saucepan. I'm guessing that's how I clean rags, and then I can use clean rags for bandages. That's what I'm guessing. So... Yep. I'm, I'm actually gonna... I'm heading back to... Yeah, I got diarrhea. This is not a time to be fighting people. Let's just get the fuck out. And he's ran into me. Dude, I will beat the shit out of you. Okay, I gotta beat you up. <laughs> Holy shit! What the fuck just happened there? Raider is stunned and unable to move for a moment. Player smashed Raider's lower chest with a monkey wrench. Raider is coughing up blood. I stunned him, he coughed up blood. He's... Jesus Christ. I beat the loving shit out of this guy. You know what, you wanted to fuck with me? Fuck you then. Where you going, huh? You're going on the ground, mate. So I can kick you when you're down. Suck on that bitch. Yeah, I wanted to be left alone. This guy, I crippled his... I'm oh, Jesus. I'm loving this monkey wrench. Look at that damage I did. Jesus. Okay, what did he... He only had a sleeping bag. Son of a bitch. Thought he'd had more. Ah oh well, gotta scavenge that other house. Okay, we didn't upset the beast. And painkiller's empty. Okay, we got both those recipes, it's okay. Now show me, yeah, we want to go cryo facility. Oh god, let's stay away from that. Oh god, I can't. Oh god, I'm surrounded. He... The dog didn't... Oh god. Oh god, it's night. Minor pain, this is not good. Come on, buddy, get me there. Get me there alive. Oh, unknown encounter, take cover, and get the fuck out, okay. There were items on the ground, I do not know. Right, camp please, for the love of god. Let's drink. Let's eat some saltines. I said eat them, you fool. What do you even... God damn it. Drink. 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 Eat this shit. <laughs> right, I just emptied my entire stock. Oh no, still got some crackers. Jesus. That was like an entire. Oh, ketchup! Drink it! 
Now leave all this crap here, we won't be needing it. Taking the painkillers with me, and that can stay here. All this crap can stay here. What do I need now? And an electrical panel. I need an electrical panel. Okay. Not enough moves left. Okay, so I can do it. This is good. I want to... Okay, I'm infected. Let's sleep. Sleep again. Oh god, I'm gonna die in my sleep. Please wake up. Please wake up. Please wake up. Please wake up. And I'm dead. Gone to sleep. <laughs> Basically, he died while sleeping, shitting himself to death. <laughs> oh, what a way to go! Yep. Oh well, we had a good run. I was kind of happy about that. That that went well, I think. Um, it's been an hour. So, I'm going to call this a video, so, because I'm going to upload this to YouTube, um, see you next time, and uh, people on the stream, just hold on a second, I'll do something else, okay, so, see you soon.